getting people to understand of the history of the African American experience when it comes to, when, when it co- comes to food, um, it's it, it has been embedded. The food system has been embedded um, for for so long in terms of uh, what we what we're eating now. And the only way that's going to really change it is really to educate people to understand that food for so long has been used as a weapon yeah. against the black community, black and brown community. Is used as 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 a weapon against us, and as a result, you're seeing the dire related diseases that is happening that's killing our our our, um, our population. I even make this statement that our food is killing us as part of a, a genocide that yeah. is that's happening. I hate to have to use that strong word, but I'm just saying it's part of a genocide that's happening within our communities as food is being used as a weapon against us. Because yeah. it's something that we all need to have, but yet, um, in communities of color, that food is processed food, junk food, and fast food, um, and making people aware of that fact. Hopefully, um, I, like I said, yeah, it's true. I mean, people people don't realize that that you know, while gun violence is horrible and needs to stop, that it's a fraction of the amount of people that die in these communities compared to diet-related diseases that are totally preventable. 